Hi, we're back with Project Morpheus in Croatia. We are trying to find some uh, a cave under the monastery, which should be connected to the spring that alimentates also the cave. So there is uh, one of the springs that been submerged by forming a, a Perucha lake in the late 50s. So we are trying to localize the, the, the spring and the cave and understand what is the potential for water. Yes, the project Morpheus continues. More and more divers are coming here to Croatia. We keep on trying to find and document new caves. Perucha is a huge artificial lake near the Serbian border. We scout the bottom in search of underwater springs. We found a spring. The bad news is that the spring is not diveable, so it's diveable only from the lake. So we can see where the water is coming out, but it's not possible to penetrate. There are many, many small holes, but that's it. To continue our work, we had to meet with the local head honcho to get his blessing, plus we arranged some extra assets. Rather odd and hilarious way of transportation for heavy tech divers. We checked some positions on the lake that we plan to focus on later this year. We are in the middle of the Perucha Lake. Perucha, the most famous lake in all Croatia. <laughs> <laughs> he hates me. Meanwhile, back in the caves near Knin, further work continues. This time, we measure the caves with precise detail. All of the teams get special training in cave surveying. Using proper techniques, we gathered the data. Then, we put the measurements into the computer to make a 3D model of the caves. Unfortunately, for this time, the work is finished. After the heavy rain, the current is very strong. Too strong to dive. Sounds like we will not be able to dive at all. Yesterday morning, the furious uh, storm rain started. It's hard to assume uh, how much time we need to, to be able to enter the cave. Unfortunately, it looks that we will not be able to dive in this cave today or even not tomorrow. We will be back here this year. Please come back soon, very soon. <laughs>